what is up guys minty here and i'm gonna be showing you how to get the reverse swish effect in your edits also this effect does not look as good as after effects but it's still pretty close and looks relatively the same this is a plugin so you guys are gonna need to download it and i'll leave a link in the description on how to do that so i already rendered this clip out so this tutorial would go through faster so the swish sound effect is already in here and if you guys don't know what that sounds like then here it is if you don't know how to do that all you gotta do is drag in your intervention fire right click it and then hit reverse and this is what it should sound like there you go next you're gonna right click the clip hit properties disable resample and I don't know why but that really helps now you're gonna drag in magic bullet looks hit edit and then drag in the color correction of your choice hit finished click animate now go to the part where the swish sound effect starts happening and then add a keyframe. Now go to the part where he shoots his gun at about here and then add another keyframe. Then go five frames out. One, two, three, four, five. And then add another one. Now you'll have three keyframes. Go to the first one, click edit. Go to Tools, Lens, and Lens Distortion. Set the distortion to zero, click Enter. Hit Finished. Go to the second keyframe, click Edit. Go to Tools, Lens Distortion. And then set the distortion to negative 62. Uh, and then click Finished. Go to keyframe number three, click Edit. Go to lens distortion again, and then set the distortion to zero. All right, now I'm gonna preview render this clip out and I'll be right back. All right guys, I'm back. Now this is what your clip should look like when you're done. Again, this does not look as good as After Effects, but it still looks pretty good. Please drop a like if you enjoyed the video and if it helped you in any way, and I'll see you guys next time.